body Cause I don't wanna hurt nobody Did it over text, didn't call me Still got love for your mommy I know you wanna be somebody Even if you gotta leave somebody It's all good, it's all good Most of the things I don't wanna say I won't be around while you chase <sighs> Guys, oh my god I think I need to see before I get my thoughts together and update you guys on what the heck we've been through. In the through. past 24 fucking hours. No. Jesus. Hello, 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 hello. So, me and Tamara are ready. We are in Singapore and it's Tamara's birthday tomorrow. Woo, 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 woo. But we've had a rough 24 hours, guys. Like, it's been really, really rough. Um, so, basically, we lost our flight. We missed our flight, sorry. Um, I don't know why. I thought it was 12 o'clock. <laughs> I thought it was 12 o'clock. And then we had this idea that we'd get up at 8.30, go for breakfast. No, get ready, go for breakfast, and leave by, like, 9.30 to get to the airport by 10. Me, I wake up now. I knew I should have put my alarm on for eight, but then I decided to put it on for half eight anyway, just so that I can get that extra 30 minutes of sleep. Wake up now at 8.30, get in the shower. Tamara's like, Joyce, she said something, I couldn't hear her. Unless she came in. <laughs> she was like... I had to barge in, in oh my shower, God. because this was what? important. She was like, the flight says it's like 9, 9.20. Well, 9.20. I said, oh. What? Yeah. What is going on the here? Like what? Came on my phone. I read it. I was like, wait. Jesus. <laughs> That's in 35 minutes. What do you yeah. mean? As soon as I got out that shower, I just knew like we're gonna try, but I know we're not gonna make this this flight. Yeah. So we're going downstairs now. Pack our things like super quick. Then that's the fastest we've ever done anything. <laughs> Literally packed our things so quickly. Went downstairs, checked out quickly, got the taxi. Tabra was getting annoyed with that. With her. <laughs> <laughs> with, our, with our security, was the security guards? Yeah. Our servicemen, because they weren't trying to get, well, they did try to get the taxi, but it, it was taking was forever. A, yeah. Um, so yeah, so by the time the taxi came, it was five past nine, and our flight said nine twenty. So, and it takes us 20 minutes from our airport to the, um, to the DXB airport, so it was like, yeah, we hotel, we yeah. went yeah uh, from our hotel to the airport, so we just weren't gonna make it, but we tried our best, anyways. Um, and then we called them. We called Emirates. Like, mm. listen, okay, we've got into an accident. <laughs> Please, can you help us out, like, yeah. in terms of arranging another flight for us? Mm. They told us, yeah, cool. <laughs> in the evening but it's three hundred and forty pound each. I think it was like three hundred and eighty something. I'm sure. No, I said three. 340? No, it said 380. Because it was close, yeah, it's close to 400, yeah. And then me and Joyce had to deliberate because, yeah. wow, like... I got the money right now, I know, it's a lot of money. We told her that we'd ring her back because we'd call our travel centre to see what they could do, but then when we tried ringing the travel centre, it was closed. And then I went to the ticket sales um, for Emirates in the actual airport. And when I went to them, they were telling me, oh, we only have higher fares available, higher fares available, and they're like 500 and something pounds per person, so altogether you'd be paying a thousand pounds to get onto the next flight. Bear in mind, next flight was like, like 3 a.m. So I'm hearing these price and I'm like, mm, nah, let's go let's call try and call our travel centre or, or the, the Emirates, the Emirates the over the phone. Call. So we rang back now and they're telling us there's no, <laughs> there's no seats available. We're like, Fuck, like, what do we they do? They only have um, first class available. First class, 2K. 2,000. Who got 2, 2, Not me. So Not me. 2,000. One way ticket to Singapore. So no, it's never, never that, that deep. deep. Yeah, it's never that deep. <laughs> never that deep. Yeah, at that point, we were like, <laughs> Like, yeah. We were literally going through it, like, we're like, we fuck, we're like, what do, like, this is our, we, we obviously have to get to Singapore so that we can go to Bali, because our flight was from Singapore to Bali, um, I guess in a few, in a few days, so if we didn't make it to Singapore, we can't make it to Bali. Bali. <laughs> You know what I mean? And we ain't finna do that. Yeah, that's the place that we're looking forward to. The to the most. most, yeah. Imagine I forgot my battery charger, camera, my camera charger at the hotel. So I had to go back to the hotel, get my charger, come back. 
to the airport and whilst I was on the journey I looked for some flights and I found a cheaper alternative I found um an indigo flight so we had to stop at India oh my god <laughs> Wait. The night so, wait. In India. It was a lot. Okay, what so an the flight that we got was only leaving at like 8.50. Cool. So that means we stayed the whole day basically at the XB at the airport waiting for this flight. It was freezing, it was the cold. Like it was just oh like it was just not the nicest of situations. So comes the flight now, we board, everything's calm, plane's a bit rusty, but you know what? Beggars can't be choosers. Mm. So we landed in Chennai now, so we had to stop over at Chennai for a few hours. Bro, that is that was the most ghetto airport I've ever, ever, ever like landed Nobody in. Nobody knew anything. Nobody there could was help us. No organization, <laughs> no were, nothing. We were arguing. Yeah. It was a crazy, crazy scene. But then we finally left Chennai and then we're here in Singapore. Woohoo! Woo so we're essentially like so 24 hours late into Singapore. Yeah. Um, so we got here at 11 o'clock Singapore time. And yeah, I guess we've been chilling a little bit, just getting acquainted with our hotel room, which is very tiny. Not sure whether you guys can see, but literally very confined space. Yeah. Nice views nonetheless. Like it's actually gorgeous. I think Sing Singapore's nice so far. Like it's got a lot of greenery and it's like, you know, it makes me feel you know somewhat at peace which i love um so yeah so we didn't just want to i guess stay in bed and like waste another day so i guess we're just gonna go into town see what we can do around there get some food and maybe visit that um garden place the garden bay um just for something to do because we actually only have tomorrow which is tamira's birthday and then that's it and then we'll go to bali so we gotta do something um so this is my outfit of the day yeah so i got these trousers from mango quite a while back um got this top from zara slides sandals from zara bag from asos and yeah jewelry oh yeah i'm wearing my necklace that i got from dubai that says sj oh let's see <laughs> cute no, it's cute what are you wearing sis no, you can't in the honey. <laughs> um, this is just a dress from Zara. Mm. H&M flip flops. I'm still deciding what bag to wear. This one or this one is more practical. This one is just for the looks. Yeah. I don't know what to do. I think therefore this silver looks better, but, but obviously, obviously I mean you can take that and put that in the small one for your pictures and stuff. Yeah. Okay. Me personally, I think we should do Garden Bay. Yeah. Just to have an attraction to look to look at, um, I hope, I hope it's and not then because I don't want everyday taxi, taxi, taxi. I mean, it would be nice to walk. walk yeah, yeah, yeah. So guys, we just arrived. <laughs> This is so freaking cute! The mirror's matching all the trees. <laughs> so we're going to see the flower dome. Good morning, guys. It's Tamira's birthday! A bitch just turned 26. Wow. Wow. 
we get an old chair. But camera kind of died yesterday, so forgot to kind of close off the day yesterday. But all we did is we went for dinner at the boiler and had like a seafood boil to me. It's first time ever trying a seafood boil. Um, and she rated it a 6 out of 10. In the end, was it still a 6 out of 10? I've seen the Oh, shit. <laughs> Yeah, I think it wasn't the best, like it wasn't, you know, crazy, like, but I was hungry and I love seafoods. So I was happy in my element. We did want to go on the bus, but then we forgot and just booked a taxi. Um, but yeah, we got home, literally, Tamira got in the shower, she put her new wig on and I was in bed, uploaded a few things on Insta and just fell asleep, like, ugh. Annoying. I didn't even stay up till midnight to wish the girl happy Sleep birthday. <laughs> I literally just, it was literally 20 minutes before midnight. And I, was, I literally just fell asleep. Like, what is wrong with me? Um, but it's a new day. It is the 13th of October and it is, where is my phone? It's 8, yeah, it's 8 a.m. And we actually have a bike ride um, at 8.45. So it's a no makeup day today. Um, we're just gonna, you know, do a little cute hairstyle or whatever and then be gone. We've got a bike ride, a bike tour um, at nine, but we need to be there for 8.45. And it's like four hours. And it's really, why does it start so early? Like eight o'clock, nine o'clock, sorry. Like what, what is that? Early birds for all like no. That's very unnecessary. Um, but yeah, we've got a bike ride. Um, I'm wearing this cute denim number. I think I've worn it on a vlog. And my trainer is literally the same fit that I've worn before. Um, and I'm just gonna put my hair up and be gone. This is Tamira's outfit. She's wearing like a two piece. Yeah. From Zara. From Zara, Zara, Zara. I don't Zara. know if I like this, but do go with it. Go I think with the curly hair it'll be, are you leaving it down? Yeah. Yeah, it'll look nice. Nice. We're just gonna finish getting ready and then be out, so catch y'all soon. Guys, look at the back of our hotel. How gorgeous. Anyways, we need to grab something quick to eat because we're going straight to the bike ride and I don't think they stop the food and stuff. Weather's gorgeous, it's like, well, Maybe we're in the shade, but it's not too sunny. But again, it's still warm and hot and humid. Lovely. Hi. Hello. Would I be able to pay my card? Yes. Card? Uh, thanks for choosing to spending in Singapore. Mm -hmm. Okay, first good good friend. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I brought you here to celebrate. Yeah. Best piece. <laughs> okay, come let me help you. Okay, do you want me to sit down? Try it. See this uh, paper route. Slight details, good. But increase. Yeah, small one. Decrease is the big one. And what what would we need to increase some decrease? Uh, about four is good because uh, Singapore is almost flat, so in the middle will be usually be good enough. Are you ready? Daddy. <laughs> Whoa, look at that. Whoa. <gasps> Where are they going? Gardens by the bay. Everything across the water bay. Gardens by the bay. I can't measure rap with any boat. Rather get a pack and keep it open. Big dripper stand up in the ocean. Everybody trapping, we get open. He ain't focused yet, but he ain't got motion. Get up a lion. Body of the fish. Guys, this is so stunning. Wow, Singapore is so gorgeous. I absolutely love it. And I'm getting a tan. This whole piece is really killing me. <laughs> Like, this is... <laughs> 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 
Christmas, I bought everybody. Smoke glass and covers and infants for everyone. Take the roof off the collar, don't feel the sun. I broke my seat, it's about 5,000 months. Got this bitch off the collar, she suck it and swallow. I stick it and she feel it in a gut. These niggas don't rock on my collar, we stack in a collar. Let's go! Uh, so we're done with the bike tour. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> She's so dramatic. Oh my days. <laughs> oh my days. So we did the bike tour. We've just finished. Um, and it was, I really enjoyed it. I loved it. Like, I no, loved I seeing it. Singapore. I did love it. It was just tiring, obviously. Riding a bike nonstop yeah. for five and hours. And it was hot. So, like, it's not was, it is hot. Like, it's scorching hot. Um, but yeah, I loved it nonetheless. Like Singapore is so gorgeous, so nice. Like, oh, look at it, it's just so beautiful. So now we're on our way to get some tattoos. <laughs> Exciting. We're just going with bags, really, because we actually don't have the designs that we want. We did say we wanted the butterfly, though. I just know it was a red butterfly and one half was obviously oh, each yeah, person has yeah. one half of the of the butterfly. Um and it was literally like what five minutes I think from from where we were but we got a taxi because we have no Google Maps and we're tired. Um yeah it was a really good tour. Oh I'm scared for the tattoos though, it's actually hurt bro. It doesn't hurt. Oh my goodness. Yeah, with this honey, yeah. I feel like I want a piece of honey. You want a what? A piece of honey. A piece? Yeah. Well, what do you mean a piece of yeah, honey? Like, the piece. Oh! Oh, do you really? What do you get a hand tattoo? Yeah, I think this is cute. Okay, chill. I've never before, but. She's feeling that head of that prop up head of that, that lady did. That lady, yeah. God will go with her. But yeah, we visited like apparently back in the day, like Singapore was like split into different towns based on like people's races. Um, because a lot of them obviously came here to work and stuff like that. So we visited Chinatown, which is where obviously the Chinese settled. Then we visited what's it called? Little, Little India. India. And then I can't remember what the Arab base was called. Yeah. You know where Bada Bink is? Isn't that where it's taken us? Uh, I'm not very sure. <laughs> I don't think he does. Alright, thank you. Thank you thank so, you so much, much, yeah? Have yeah, a good so day. Bye bye. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Woo. Ooh. Wow. Now to find this tattoo shop with no Google Maps. <laughs> oh, there's one called here Monstro Tattoo, but we've been recommended Bada Bink. I think me and Tamara have lost each other. Bloody great. I found her stupid ass. How can she run away like that? I was like, that. You ran away. <laughs> I turned around and you were gone. I thought you heard me. So we think we've chosen. Probably gonna go with that second one. I wonder if it does red, because I really want red. Where well, we're gonna get it, we need to decide where we're gonna get it. Yeah. Yeah, I have one on my phone. This second one, this second butterfly. Okay. Just this one. Just this one? For yourself only, right? Or two person? Two. two matching. Okay, so for two person, you and her. Yeah. Okay, so one is this. Just this, just one. Oh, so both of you same. The same, yeah. Okay, so I don't need to uh, make them face each other. Right? Yeah, so yeah no, just no, flip it. Face, face oh, each so other. So you flip need it. to flip it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alright, uh, hold on. Did you do red ink? Uh, I don't think it will work on the skin tone. It will, yeah, because if it's uh, too dark, if you do red ink, you will be able to see. But I can just go over it in black ink if I don't yes, like correct. it. Yes, correct. You should go with black ink. 
Hmm? You should go with black colour ink. No, I'm saying if you do it in red, I can just go over it in black, right? If I don't like it. Uh, yes, correct. So at yeah. the end of the day, I can do it in red. Mm -hmm. But if you don't like it, uh, maybe when you guys go back or mm. anything really, you guys can do it you can over just go in black. black yeah. So do you guys want to do it in red or black? I really want red. You can do black if you want, but I really want red. Yeah, I want mine filled in. Did I update the vlog? No. No. Anyways, we didn't do much. We literally just came back. I slept. Um, we got up late and you know, we start getting ready in our wear. We're late. So this is what we're wearing. So I'm wearing this jumpsuit from Roo Shop. Bag from PLT. Shoe Zara. Let's look at our birthday girl. Oi, oi. Hi, That's a lot of black number. Mm-hmm. As how <laughs> Jewelry from Amazon. Yeah. Shein. Shein. Okay, girl. So we're off to dinner. Um, we're supposed to be there by 9.30. And it's currently... It's and we need to book the cab. So... I kind of want to light. Wow. 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 Well, uh, yeah, how are you? I'm gonna nah. You talk a lot of shit, but let me see if you can walk. You got desires. I know. I hear. You got desires. I know. I know. You got desires. Open my hand bag. Thank you. Yeah. 
in the background on your <laughs> Yeah, you were. You were. <laughs> I went to sleep. No, I, no, I was going to sleep. Yeah, when I know. Go, go, go. to end our Singapore vlog um, I think last thing you saw was us going out um, for Tamara's birthday we went to the club went for some food and then a club um, and we got super drunk like we just got really drunk and <laughs> we had a flight to catch early in the morning um, yeah so we went to sleep drunk and then woke up late and then we were just faffing around with like packing because we didn't pack and then we had issues with luggage and then our flight and stuff like that so it was a lot going on so i didn't really get the chance to update the vlog vlog um but yeah we're in bali now so make sure you go watch the next vlog which will be us in bali um but yeah singapore was good it was great i loved it city vibes very green very clean um is a tad expensive though but it is what it is it's a really nice city um so yeah i would definitely recommend to a friend um i wouldn't recommend the hotel though um the hotel i feel like was very cramped for a very small for two people um with two big luggages even three um girls getting ready it's just you know it's very tight um, but it was a clean hotel, I guess. Um, customer service wasn't that great. I asked for them to prepare something for Tamira's birthday for when we got back. I would have paid, but came back to nothing. It was crickets. And then when I spoke to him, he was like, oh, really? Nothing? I was like, no. You know you didn't leave anything. Um, so I don't feel like they're very accommodating. So we stayed at the Mercure Singapore on Stevens Hotel. So, yeah, I wouldn't really recommend that. I'd give that like a six. 7 out of 10 yeah but my whole stay in Singapore in general was just amazing like I loved it 10 out of 10 we went on bike ride um we went out to like their strip their like nightlife area it wasn't that great um so I don't think Singapore is really the place to go clubbing if that's what you're into um what else did we do out there yeah, I'd say Gardens by the Bay as well is really nice, but I wouldn't pay $28 again to go see it. Like, it's really something that you just do once just to say you've done it. But um, it is nice. It is nice to walk around and see it, but I just don't feel like the price is worth it because you're literally just walking around looking at flowers and trees and stuff like that. So, yeah. But yeah, I love the stay. I love Singapore. Definitely go there if you can. Definitely put it on your bucket list. It's definitely one of my favourites so far. It really reminds me of Rio, Brazil. Just because of like the greenery and the city vibes. Like I just loved it. Um, and the people were quite friendly as well. So yeah, give it a go. But yeah, that's the end of this travel vlog. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I hope that you go watch my next one and my other videos. And make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. Bye. Tamara's over here sleeping like one granny. To be fair, it is two o'clock. Oh, oh, got the middle finger. It is 2.30 in the morning. I just finished laying down my hair. So I'm going to sleep as well, so.